Hello, alchemists. Thanks for joining me, Lone Hawk, for this episode of Mythic Ranked Alchemy. Today, we'll go over our Magic the Gathering best of one alchemy deck, then show it in action against the top players in Arena today. I'll wrap up with a quick review, potential substitutions, and a look forward. With that, let's get to the deck. Today's deck is double combo. It incorporates both the Peregrine Took and Experimental Confectioner combo, the infinite combo that gives you card draw and limitless rat tokens, and the Three Blind Mice and Dedicated Dollmaker combo, which gives you exponentially growing Three Blind Mice artifact enchantment tokens that spit out tons of white to mouse tokens and overrun your opponent. To support those two, we have Delighted Halfling for ramp and a little bit of uncounterable for our legend, Peregrine Took. We've got Assemble the Team to search for our combo components. Tough Cookie supports the Took Confectioner combo. We've got Go for the Throat for removal. We've got Legions to Ashes for all the token removal if we're in the mirror match. We've got uh, the Huntsman's Redemption to search for our creatures for combo. We've got Porcine Portent for a little bit of removal. Can get rid of both creatures and artifacts. Uh, we've got Mondrak Glory Dominus, one copy that we can search for because everything we're doing is done with tokens, and Mondrak gives us the ability to double those tokens. We've got Virtue of Loyalty to summon a knight token at instant speed, and then pump our field and untap it for a quicker victory with three blind mice, and we've got Virtue of Persistence to do some removal, and if the game stretches out, we can start bringing our combo pieces back. On the land side, we've got Captivating Crossroads, of course. It's a multicolor land that you pick a color when you play it. It only comes in tapped if you are the first player, and if it is the first three turns. So it is great mostly untapped land. We've got Murex for even yet more tokens. We've got Restless Cottage for more tokens, specifically food tokens, and it is great against control decks because it can't be countered, and if they're not running spot removal, uh, it is uh, tough to get rid of. Similarly with Restless Fortress, We've got the Shire for a food token in a pinch. And then some uh, dual lands, the pain lands, to smooth out the mana further. All right, let's get to the ladder and see this thing in action. Ooh, got the double combo. We do need... We do need a land, we do need a white land. We... Might as well put that one out there. Yeah, there's really no other choice because we want to have three mana available the next turn. The Moria Marauder. Uh, which land do we want to play? I think we want to play... Electric. Do they have a lightning bolt in there? I think they... I will, in fact, block. I got, like, a Monstrous Rage. Blazing Crescendo. 
Still, it keeps them from drawing cards. Or from getting cards to play. And guess what? We have... We'll put out the confectioner this time. Next turn. Depends on what they show here, but thinking that we'll be able to play Just fine, wasting those blazing comp blazing crescendos on our Yeah, I mean We'll create another food token. Don't think we want to use the doll maker yet. We'll leave the mana open in case we need to eat. Interesting. First time I've seen Legions to Ashes. This time, I think we just, we just win. Not our ideal. We got some nice removal though. Got good land on the play. Gonna need some white. Probably should have played the crossroads there. Don't think we want to go for the throat here. This card, interesting. 
Now do our spare go for the throat. Interesting, a discard dollmaker combo. Um, now it gets a little more difficult. Definitely don't want that. I think maybe we do Mondrak. We definitely want the portent. And all right. Uh, and do we want to go for the throat there? Before we lose any more cards, I think so. Now let's get a blocker out there. our land draw. They don't. Juggernaut Peddler. Nice. They dust the other half of our combo and then what? Think hmm, that is tough. So tough. We want to I think being able to play our stuff is gonna be more important than making sure we don't have pain lands. Let's see. Do we do we exile? I think so. Let's get that out of our hand. Cancel attacks. No attacks. Don't really need to be taking the poison. Yeah, this is not looking great. Uh, next to combat, and turn. We have six. Virtue of loyalty does me no good. This actually does do a fair amount of good. Hmm. That's an artifact. No, it's not an artifact. Hey. Again. Two 
slow. Well, this looks pretty darn good. We got the acceleration. We got the ability to search for a, uh, the Peregrine Took. We will we'll play this. We are on the draw. Oh, and we get. Looks like they are playing the Azorius version. You will Restless Cottage. They pass. Let's see, I'm trying to remember what they have for counters. Let's let's play the planes and let's play Peregrine took. They reprieve. That's fine. Get half of the other combo. Let's see. Let's. Yeah, let's rest this cottage. And we will. Took again. It sticks. They draw, gain life. You cannot gain enough life. Now, next turn is a potential sunfall turn. And we cannot actually. Yeah, we cannot actually make this go off. So let's assemble the team. Let's see what we get here. This may have been the wrong order. Probably should have attacked first. They reprieve. So they draw a card. We will go to combat. Do we assemble the team again? I think so. Let's do that. Because we would really like to find three blind mice here. Double reprieve. They are going to let that go. Well, we can make the combo go off here. If we can get uh, Confectioner down. Let's try it. Oh, and they impulse. They got a search. They must be searching for, what is it, the fourth reprieve? Did they find their last reprieve? All right, we get one, and we do this. Tap that one. We can still attack. All right. Help me turn my channel into gold. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you'd like to see, and I will do my best to deliver. To get us above what they can do with last pass, our last, their life gain spell. So that gives us 31. That should be enough. Uh, next to combat, next to attackers, I'll attack. They aren't giving up, which tells me they do have a sunfall. We will end turn and get rid of a bunch of land. Uh, six cards. 
Um, we'll get rid of that one. Like that. Like that. Like that. Like that. Uh, that can go. And we need one more. Uh, I guess the tough cookie. Submit six. We will. Uh, yeah, doesn't. <laughs> they have one big token. Um, I think we want. Yeah, we definitely want more white. If the combo fails at first, try, try again. And let's see. Then I think we might as well do that. Um, yeah, let's take the virtue. Or actually, Legion to Ashes is going to be better. It can remove. Yeah, it can remove the. Oh, another sunfall! Oh, that's bad. <laughs> Good game. Okay, this will work. Maybe. Possibly. Don't have white. This looks like the Legends deck. It is not the Legends deck. Uh, I think we should... Oh, I should have virtued that. Not quite sure what I was thinking. I'll get rid of that guy. Then. All right. Uh, we a tough cookie. Celestia. Okay, still looking for white. Let's see, attack. And confectioner. Yeah. No. No, no, interesting. I don't, you rarely see that. Uh, here we go. Let's play the halfling. Yeah. And virtue. Take out one of them. And attack. They play the halfling. Oh, this looks like an adapted five color. Another confectioner. Do we try and exile Hajar? We do not. They just gain indestructible, so we can still exile if we want. Come on, Pippin, or Peregrine. Alright, um, yeah, there's not much we can do here. Next, next two attackers, but if we can get, and uh, no attacks. 
We get Peregrine down. That should be game. Going for the card draw before they do the rest of their turn. They get Skrells. Alright, uh, my turn. Fine, Peregrine took, and yes, we have to sacrifice the tough cookie, but we get it. got good removal. We have runnable lands. We need a green. But... Lots of removal. Hopefully they don't get a hold of Definitely not letting you have that. Another delighted halfling. Do they miss a land drop? We would really like them to miss a land drop. isn't looking so good. We, we both have slime drops. Unfortunately, they have mana acceleration, so they can play big threats. They don't miss their fourth land drop, and we're out of traffic. Hoarded creature. Let's get some... Um, is going to get bad in a hurry. Uh, yeah, exiling that does not work. Unfortunately, they only have two cards left. Two thirds of the combo that they may not. I didn't get that. Could you try again? Yeah. 
Yeah. Oh, nice. It is dies. So we're still in trouble. Got to try it. Though. This probably would have been better last turn. Uh, no attacks. Yeah, in fact, they have six, seven, eight. We can block five. Good game. No blocks. Oh, this looks pretty good. We don't have the combo up. But... We can Virtue into Huntsman's. I have all three colors. So, yeah, we will keep. And... Cottage. Question here is do we want to next do we want to give them the opportunity to use that? Uh okay. I think we would rather use it on what comes out than than the half lane itself. We will try it this way at least. Do they want to use a three cost creature? Uh, resolve. And two attackers. I think, uh, yeah, virtue. Oh, keep with our plan. And huntsman. Yeah, we would trade still. Fair enough. They have two. And do they have a ruby? And we got a combo. So... We will decline. Um, they do run Terra Sunder, so I think we want to. Yeah, we want a tough cookie. And leave it. Next, and no attacks. In preparation for next turn, go for the throat is open. They tear us under that. That is just great news for us. And we will end turn. They did that on my end step. So let's see what they do with their four mana. I am... I am happy to trade here. Kind of seems like they... Yep, they just have a lot of LSL cool cores. And do we want to remove that one? They're going to run out sometime here. Yeah, let's do that. It beats Radagrabic coming out. 
We may regret it if they drop. Well, they chose black, so. Good game. It is a lot of fun if you like combos. I think we're happy with how it performed. I don't know that a whole lot of modifications are necessary. I might swap out one of go for the throat to another legions uh terra sunder is also a possibility here to give us a little bit cheaper enchantment removal another possibility would be more porcine portent or another mondrak but it performs so i'm gonna post the deck list like this thanks for watching till the end if you enjoyed this video I would love to hear what you enjoyed in the comments, and please like and subscribe for more like this. We've got a few more decks coming in the waning days of the October season, and then we will be doing stuff in preparation for Caverns of Ixalan. Should be an exciting couple of weeks. Until next time... May alchemy magic turn your day to gold.